Hi guys, this is a problem of question number 15, college students from night, chapter 5, um, applying Newton's law. In this uh, problem, I have a question in my hand, causing a car stops in 311 per second from a speed of 40 meters per second. The driver has a mass of 70 kilograms, but force is applied to the driver to a fraction of a second. So this is the problem right here. So what force is applied to the driver by his seatbelt during that fraction of a second? This is a car that's driver. The force applied on the seatbelt will pull the driver back. Here's the force of seatbelt. The car stops. There should be a fraction. Here's the weight always acting down. Here's the um, normal force. So sorry, this is the normal force. Um, there we go. Always acting upwards. That is the car weight of the car force. Okay. There we go. We're going with time. We're going with final velocity. We're going with mass. We're going with. We have to find out the mass. This is pretty easy. Apply the kinematics equation. You need to find your VF and you got your VI, you got your T. You got your VF, you got your T, you just have to find your A for your force formula, right? So you got 40 meter per second over 0.10 so the acceleration. Acceleration will be 140 meter per second squared. Since we need to define force, that's all we need. So force of signal is equal to MA. Force of seat belt equals to 70 kilograms, which is already given up here, right up here. And then in the 140 meters a second square, which is just the final, 800, 800 meters or 9.8 exponential meters. Thanks for watching.